And welcome back guys, we're going to be playing some more Cyberpunk 2077 Remastered. Make sure to like button, make sure to subscribe button, let's get into it. Nancy? I mean... Bess? Bess Isis? No, this is her underpaid underappreciated assistant. Steven, N54 News, how can I help? Wanna to talk to Bess? She's not here. Calling from Carrie Uridine's residence. Cool. But Bess still isn't here. She was supposed to be back two days ago. Went to the Totentons to shoot some stuff, story on Maelstrom. Call back next week or just watch the news. If anything happens to her, I'll be the first to cover it. Got a bad feeling, V. Think we better head to the Taunton tent. All right. I'll give him that one. Would you like to drive it? Sure. Be there soon. Oh, see? It is awesome! So I hear. Thank you. 
Oh no, that's weird. It wouldn't let me use the fast travel. So I'm guessing I'm either driving to location. That's what's going on. You can see I was struggling on the map that I, it would not let me teleport for the life of me. Like, I'll try again here in a second since I get to a fast uh, station point. So, let's see here, which is the closest one. I'll try, I'll go here and I'll try again the fast travel. But I have a feeling it's one of those quests where you kind of have to drive over. So, we'll see what happens. Enjoy playing the game, uh, taking a break from Skull and Bones. I don't like how farmy and, you know, in general, in general, the game of Skull and Bones is just really farming for any. It's just not very enjoyable. Let's try to drop the clip here real quick. Or drop it off the clip. Hey, what's up, Judy? Hey, Judy, what's up? V. Can you come over a step? Something happened? Yeah. Just come. I got it stuck. Alright, I guess we're... on foot. <laughs> <laughs> well, my plan was to drive it off the cliff to there, not where we ended up. That was not the plan. Alright. Let's see if I can recall it. Where is that fast travel line? Where is it taking me? Brick Road, I guess. So I'm guessing going up there. Oh, I think. Maybe I know where. Japan Town? The fast travel option wasn't coming up before, but now it is. It must have been that location we're in. I just didn't like it. Alright, let's get back into it.
all starting to come together. No media would ever go for the taunt and tense. Except Nancy. your style minimalist used to have chrome just like that Totem start to moving fuck yeah five four I, I press the button <laughs> oh, my fingers are numb Did Royce? No, 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 no. Wouldn't be that stupid to show up here. You the one? Yeah. What anyone actually boo-hoo when he went? Look at this. A chance at a nick in the barrel. Get the fuck out! Now! That's the all foods, punk. I'm not blind! What do you want? Watch out for that. Best one. ISIS. Mean anything to you? You work with her? No, just gotta talk. Heard she's here. She's here, but you talk to Brick first. Pest call what happens to you. I'll take you. So Brick's in for Royce now. Yeah, heard what happened at All Foods. Probably thinking Brick will be grateful, huh? What, that'd disappoint you? No, and Brick's not in a position to demonstrate feelings of any kind. Yeah, and by alternative, you mean we don't give a fuck what people think? Okay, then let's say extreme music. What's that mean to you? Look, lady, you keep trying to slap a label on us. No, I'm trying to understand you. Chaos, uh, a wall of noise and distortion. It must all form some sort of system or style. Prick, got another guest. V, hey, what a surprise. What can I do for you? It's like I'm interrupting. That's Nant. Wrapping up, actually. I see you overstayed her welcome. Yet I still haven't gotten answers to all my questions. Make something up. You're a journalist. Should be second nature. Say it's an orgy of noise or whatever. Carrie Uridine sent me with some biz for Bess. Carrie? Did he suddenly remember I exist? You can go. Huh? Just like that? I ask you. No, that's what I thought. I'm trying to run a business here. Thanks, Brick. That was... enlightening. Let's go. Let's Delta. Appreciate it. Thanks. Rick seems all right. Sure. Just too bad he doesn't know squat about music. That's what you wanted to talk to him about? Yeah, tinnitus, the totentant sound. What I got out of brick was scop. Why is the elevator 
so damn slow in this dump. Cars outside. So what? Giving up on your story? I won't learn anything about Maelstrom's music? Got lots of footage. Need to look through it, see what I can patch together. Okay, come on. Fuck. Just hope the car's still where I parked it. Brick was the safe option. Really should have talked to the asses from Tinnitus. You got some sort of in with them? Brick invited me to one of their gigs. Problem is the lineup changes every time. Oh, for fuck's sake! Ah, oh, could've been worse. This way you got a souvenir. Fuck souvenirs. I'm headed straight back to the editing room. Wanna talk? Gotta come with me. Conquer like this. Hope it gets us there in one piece. All right. So what's Carrie want? Wants to bring back samurai. One gig, one night. There is no samurai without Silverhand. I'll play for Johnny. <laughs> you. Let's just say Silverhand was more visionary than musician. You got this. Trust me. Well, if you got Carrie on board, what's in it for me? A reunion with some old friends. Ah, come on. Carrie and Johnny were friends. That's it. We just floated around, sometimes got in their way. So what do you want? An interview with Carrie? <sighs> Could write that myself, straight out of my ass. I'd want access to all his industry contacts, associates. Eh, not a problem. Not as far as I can see. Hop out. All right, so the concert? Tell Carrie I'll put it together. Be in touch. Okay, thanks. Went pretty damn well. Now call Carrie. Yep, she agreed. Even said she'd organize the gig. Still a control freak. Awesome. Managed to contact Henry or Denny? Just Henry so far. Dragged him out of rehab. Great story, actually. Henry didn't know. Denny's been in Night City all this time. On his way over to see her now. Gonna be a surprise. We're all gonna meet over at Denny's. What, me too? Why? You're gonna play with us, aren't you? you? Gotta meet the others. Send you the address. It burns like fire! Ah!
what happened here? She must have been renovating. Henry must have borrowed the truck. Gonk always was good at improvising. Maybe they're home. Try the intercom. You fucking See, girl! Carrie Peter. V. Who boy? Uh, Danny, you what is your backup? Problem. Problem. In case you forgot why the hell you came here in the first place? Carrie sent me. About the concert. What concert? Why isn't he here talking to me? We're bringing back Samurai. One night only. That's what he wants to get the crew together for? Sweet, but no fucking way. Not about to play with this shit stain. Danny! No, no way. Either him or me. Choose. Danny digs in her heels. We're done. How's it going? Like shit, man! Danny wants me out of the gig! And we already agreed on everything! What? Carrie's paying you? That's what this is about? Fuck. This is all fucking great. So you get him away from me and get the fuck off my lawn! Don't make me choose. Pretty sure it's your call. Fuck really pisses me off. Denny's on a control kick, setting conditions. On the other hand, Henry's got scop for brains. Can't trust him. Thanks. Real helpful. <sighs> if we gotta choose, let's play with Denny. Fuck, Carrie! Seriously? She's the one making a big deal out of this, not me! Listen, I'll get you- You know what, Carrie? Fuck you! Good thing Silverhand isn't here to see this. You done? Get out. All right, what about Nancy? We make contact. She's gonna set it all up and let us know. See you at the show. Fuck. Now I gotta find someone to clean this up. Okay, about all we can do for now. Except wait for Nancy to call. herself to express her undying gratitude to you. Stop talking. I was... I was only gone an hour. You, you checked your pulse? V... She's gone. How did this happen? I don't know. I told you. Evie was lying in bed, like always, when I went out, and I got back to... Fuck. If I'd just known, I'd have... Gotta do something with her. Don't want any trouble. I'm calling the badges. Can you carry her to the bed? As if that'll change anything. I need to report an accidental death. Northside, Jackson Street. No. No imminent danger. 
<laughs> Suicide. Simone! No! Today! What part of dead don't you understand? No, she was not pronounced dead by trauma team. If she'd have had coverage, we wouldn't be talking. And fuck you! If you don't want to move your asses, why don't I come down to the precinct and trash it into bits? Now will you come and arrest me, you pussies? Fine, I don't give a fuck what you write me up for. They'll be here soon. <laughs> Told me to keep her on ice until tomorrow. Can you believe the balls? You know... To you, she's your best friend, so... It's a terrible tragedy. But... They must get dozens of calls like this every day. What are you? The fucking PR rep? No, just saying. Put something on her. I'd rather she look like a person than a body. Could you wait outside? Close the door, V. Please. Bummer, Sig. Didn't know you smoked. <sighs> Quit. It's been years. But right now I need something besides air in my lungs. Please, V, just one. Fine, here. That was her smoke case. She smoked some... Strange boutique brand. That's Evie. Whenever she pulled on a new face, it was down to the details. A lot of people know the real Evelyn. Who she really was? No. Nobody. I let her down. I thought if I gave her some t space or time, she'd get back on her feet. God, I can't wrap my head around it. Never saw Evelyn as the type to give up. Come on. What she went through? I wouldn't call it giving up. Her condition... Couldn't think about anything else. Tech-wise, she was clean. Doll Shard was operational, uncorrupted. So... Psychological trauma. Had to be that. Did some more digging in her virtues. Found Woodman. He kept her. And had his way with her. The things he did. And once he got bored, he pawned her off. I had no idea that guy was such a monster. Saw him as your... Average Trixie sleazebag. It puts on a convincing facade. I knew him, but I never thought him that sick in the brain. Gotta be something I can do about it. Like what? Don't know yet. Think I'll call Suze. Thanks, V. Sorry, but uh, I'd rather be alone now. Promise to keep in touch. Anything comes up, holler on the hollow.
Spinder. Little more time. Yeah, yeah, you turn it. In. All ready to go? Hey, V. No, not yet. Carol still needs to check if Militech left any ice in the systems. Corpos haven't shown up in person to report the loss? No, I think we managed to keep them off our scent. We left the trucks with the big Corpo logos down by the Raffin camp, which was almost as much fun as leaving a bag of flaming dog shit on their doorstep. Fuck, made it look like he just came back from a Corpo War tour. Nice touch. Everything's fine. Clean as a whistle. Always wanted to take one of these suckers for a spin. Which is exactly how all those naive gonks landed at the front. Didn't even need to be recruited. They just showed you the tech. Go on, hop in. Everything is set. Let's fire her up. Hold on to your head. Damn it. Anybody get this thing up and running earlier? Maybe you Everything gotta... is dandy. Give me a moment. Not the latest model, but Mitch and Bob did what they could. What do you think? Well, at least now I know why people call them coffins. You steer directly from your seat. All you have to do is jack in. What, no knobs, buttons, blinky doodads? No, none. The impulse runs directly to your cerebral cortex. In a sense, the basilisk becomes an extension of your body. It's like a mystical oneness. Well, if it's so mystical and shit, why the co-pilot? Extra support? I'll tell you once we're a bit further from camp. We'll practice. Okay, if you want full functionality in an engagement, you need a second person to handle sensory overload. One pilot steers, the other handles the gun. It's oddly pleasant. You'll see. Okay. This will do fine. A dry run first. I'll disconnect for now. Doesn't need two pilots? You won't be steering and firing. Are you ready? Pan Am? Is this, uh, as designed? Neural synchronization doesn't happen at the snap of one's fingers. It'll be over soon. There. See? Okay. Starting to understand what you meant. Warm up. Don't worry. I'm not gonna watch. Just put it through a few turns. Soft, right? Seems a boat. All right, 
I can see you've grown bored. Now take her along the line of turbines. When I say so, swerve right or left before the last of them. All right. Way to do it. Right. Excellent. Now let's do some shooting. Stop and I'll activate the system. What's on the menu? Don't get excited. The Basilisk is a cargo ship by design. But it should still be a good time. All right. Last one. Better than dirt now. <laughs> okay. Practice is over. Good. Now I'm going to connect. It could feel strange. Meaning... Basilisk pilots have to be fully synchronized. That means our nervous systems will be linked. Okay. It's as if you booked a room with two beds, but got a double bed with a blanket wide enough for half. Okay, let's try this. This'll get to know you better than I'd planned. All right. Let me just say, it can be difficult at first. You'll experience feedback, sensory echoes as our systems overlap. Probably comes naturally in combat. Mm-hmm. Right. Starting now. wrong. You were right. That's the truth. May it never happen again. But I, I, I made a mess of so many things. 
You said- I know, but I changed my mind. You risked everything for this family, not even knowing whether you'd be welcome the next day. Okay. Okay. Well, I... Many things will have to change. Yes, and to start with, we need to leave this place. Quickly. We can't wait for Militech to find us. Of course. An interesting day. I feel as if I've barely evaded a rapidly approaching train. It's pretty close. I don't know if I could have done it without you. <laughs> Come on. Shit. No, I'm serious. Did you see the Basilisk connection? We all owe you. It blasted so you him can into count me. on the old accounts. Ah. No squirming. Lie still. I need to examine. Good to know. They won't dare show their faces again. How many did we drop? Our lord. Nobody's behind the bar. They could have been lower. That I like. That basilisk could come around sooner. Pan Am missing from camp at such a critical moment. She'll have some explaining to do. What is she to you? Beer? A Lemonade? Hell. Beer me. Leave her alone. Are you about done? Who's got a nasty ass gas too? To happy endings. Gonna miss our little escapades. Me too. On the other hand, though, who said this one was our last? V, look around. Look at them. They could be your family. And what do you stay in camp? Join us. It's really not that simple. You either want to or not. What's so complicated? That's the problem. What I want right now doesn't mean a thing. All right, V. I shouldn't drop bombs like that on you right now. I just thought... Uh, forget about it. I'll think it over. V? Pan Am. I... V, relax. Everything is okay. How do you feel? Where... Where are we? You passed out. Completely. We took you with us. Where? We moved camp. You are safe. Everything is under control. You ain't dying yet. V, you have to tell me what is happening. The blood. You were out for hours. What's wrong? Pan Am, I... 
It's getting worse. Every single day. Okay, B, relax. Take it bit by bit. What is happening, exactly? You know, Johnny Silverhand? Yes, they sometimes play those oldies on the radio. Why? That's just it. Johnny's alive. He's sitting in my head. He's what? Am, am I not? Is this some sort of strange metaphor? <sighs> Long story. Got a job, fucked it up. Now Silverhand's personality construct's sitting in my head. Bullshit. Yeah, well, he's not too happy about it either. Turns out we don't really mix. And it's getting worse. You are not joking. Just trying to live with it. Survive, actually. It's certainly not doing wonders for your health. I gotta go. Feeling better. Really. Wait. I will go with you. I thought I heard that voice. Hey, Mitch. Finally. We were worried. Took good care of your ride. She's over there. But you're not leaving us already, are you? Is everything okay? Thanks. I'll stick around for a bit. Make yourself at home. Remember, our offer still stands. If you need help, the Aldecaldos are here for you. And that, at least, we can agree on. If you need anything, you know where to find us. Want me to walk with you? I know this area, back from the old roots. You're really safe here, though? For now, yes. Militech does not venture this far. And our vantage points really are much better. But you know, everything here, About times it is temporary. All us. of it. Hey we will soon have to decide what comes next. V, back to what we were saying. I will not even pretend to understand. I don't think it has even sunk in yet. But I am serious. How can I help? Honestly, not a clue. But there has to be something. Someone who can... Remember Hellman? He's the one who created the personality construct tech. That's why you wanted to get him. But it was a dead end. Now I have to figure out where to go next. You'll find a way. And once you do, let me know. I will help. This whole family will help. Saul was not joking. You understand? Thanks, Panam. Alrighty, that looks like a good place to stop. Make sure to like button, make sure to subscribe button. I'll see you guys in the next video.